The messaging component allows you to send private messages between users on the back end of your site. They need to have access to the back end of your site in order to receive these messages. So they need to be at least a manager in the access control list or the user groups. An administrator or a manager can work. Registered author, editor, publisher does not. And of course, super user is what you are today. You have almost, you have no restrictions on your site. So in order to get this to work, we actually need to add a new user. Go ahead and click on users and click new and just add a random user, Bob. Bob is his login, Bob is his password. No, again, not the best here. For the email address, let's make this a real one. And on the assigned user group, go ahead and make them an administrator. Click save and close. Well, I guess Bob is too short of a password. <laughs> Let's go Bobby. See if that works. And indeed it does. All right, head back over to components, messaging, and let's send a new private message to Bob. You can't send one to yourself, of course. Hi, Bob. This is a message. Click send. What's happening in the background here is in Bob's email he is going to get a notification that there is a private message waiting for him on the site. And when Bob logs in, I'm just going to log out for a moment. Bob and Bobby. Down here at the bottom, there is a message indicator that says I have one message. And there it is. Click on it. Hi, Bob. And I can reply. Honestly, in the day of instant messaging, Slack, Glip, Skype, you name it, it's out there. Twitter, Facebook, email, every other messaging system we have. The messaging component probably gets very little use these days. That said, if you want the ability to send private messages between administrators on your site, then the messaging component, well, that's for you.